We got the tub spout on. Look at that. She said this is a $500 shower head. $500. I'm not sure I believe that, dude. Because you know Kohler's made in China. There ain't no way that's $500. That's what she said she paid for it. That's peculiar as heck. Look at that. That is weird. I don't, this is the... Huh. I wonder what that, it must be an issue with the diverter, right? Yeah. It's gotta, yeah, it's gotta be just an issue with the diverter. Cause that just slid right off. Yep. Not doing it now. I think this just needs to be tightened. That's that screw. I ain't doing it now. Man, I bet you that was leaking behind the wall, maybe. I don't know. Five hundred dollars. There ain't no way this was five hundred bucks, bro. Five hundred for that? No freaking way, dude. Ain't no way. That's just residual water. Yeah, that, that's just issue with the diverter. See, it kind of speeds up when you have it in the middle. See the, the flow increases and. Cause that's where it was leaking. All right. I don't know, we may have to get a new one of these. Or I just put a crappy, uh, you know, regular one on for the time being until they get another one of these. I'm gonna try this set screw first though. Dude, there's, there ain't no way this is $500, bro. It feels cheap. I get that at Home Depot for 10 bucks, bro. All right, all right, let me grab my tool. Let's try this again. There you go. How was it? Five hundred dollar shower head. I'll show you the text. I'll show you. Five hundred dollars. I mean, I'm not saying that's what she didn't pay. I'm just it ain't worth no five hundred dollars, bro. I had one just like this. It was twelve dollars off of Amazon. I mean, what would possibly make that $500? Aside from having the name Kohler. There you go. Nope. Didn't fix it. So it's the, it's the tub stop. It's the tub stop. Yep. All right. So then what we do is we're going to have to take this off. I'll put on a, uh, I'll put on a, Ooh, I don't know. I don't know if that's going to work because I would have to solder on a little, uh, I'd have to solder on a piece of pipe. 
I don't know. I have those. Uh, I'm going to take this off. I have those Moen ones. Those Moen slip on tub spouts. And maybe I could just put that on there for the time being. Just so they have. I mean, not like this is much of an issue, to be honest with you. But All right. I got a. Uh, this comes with a Delta repair uh, valves. You get Fergie's, Ferguson's. This is nice and heavy duty. I'm actually quite impressed with this one. So that's the slip-on style, and I also have the mullen that comes with the repair valve. This one's cheap. Feels cheap. Feels really cheap. And they're both similar. They just you have the slip-on. Although I think uh, I think maybe this Delta will work better. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll try the uh, we'll try the mowing here first. Okay. It's happening in the middle. That appears to have fixed it, or not. I can see it bubbling out of these. I don't know. We just seem to be doing it now. It's weird. I don't see it bubbling on these anymore. So, uh, I'm just going to tell her, we're going to leave it. I'm going to tell her to order a new tub stop, and then I'm going to call Kohler and see what, what, uh, what cartridge I need, because that would be the only other thing, because you got the cartridge, you got the tub spout coming out, and you have the, uh, riser for the shower so it's possible there's something in that cartridge that has gone bad um, but replacing the tub spout and the cartridge is going to be the, the the ultimate fix for this so that's what i'm going to recommend